Bwalia Mwinda Pole, Mrs. Chongo. I reside here in Chingola, Mbiantanj. I'm a mother of four. Um, I'm a teacher by profession. Um, I'm also a Christian. But in my Christianity life, I have been experiencing a lot of setbacks. So until the time I was introduced to come here in 20, 2019, 2018, somewhere there. But before that, I was being invited for almost four years that you should come, you should come. I kept saying, I'll, I'll go. In case, I, in case I was being invited by Mrs. Mbewe. She's a member of this church. She sings in the praise team. So she used to tell me, until when I was pregnant for my fourth pregnant, my th uh, third, that's when I, I saw a lot of spiritual battles. Then I realized I can't help myself and my spiritual stand was not very sound that I can. I used to pray, yes, the dreams were horrible. I could fight a lot of women trying to take away my child. So I experienced when my child was three years, four years, every year she would be sick in June, July. When we were having sports, I would be with Mrs. Zimbabwe two, two times I can remember. Then she, can call, she could call me or my maid would just say, Mami, would you study? What used to surprise me was when I go to the bed, I could recognize the person holding my baby, but I couldn't recognize my baby at first sight. You know, I'm a mother. I could look at her, I would say, She's got my daughter's face. She suffered. I don't know what she was suffering from. God knows until it became too much. Every, twi twice she was in the hospital, when she was three, when she was four. And then when she was turning five, she was sick again, but not in June. She was sick in May, after the father's birthday. Then my daughter, this one reminded me to say, Mom, why you shut your so like this? So I brought her to the prayer line. I didn't, I didn't go to the prayer line. I just, in the audience, I, I tapped dad and told him that, Mom, she could be sick. Papa, she would tell me, Mommy, press, you know, a three-year-old. What? She would say, Mommy, press hard. So I, I got concerned. When I told dad that, she said, Molu, you And from that time, I used to experience a Molu. Just sitting on the toilet had been a problem. Body pains. It was too much. For the past 12 days has been so horrible to me. Yesterday, I don't know, I couldn't get out of bed the whole day. I was just home, and then everyone was coming in my bedroom. Mommy, Nishi, I would say, I don't know, but I'm sick, maybe diarrhea, I don't know. Then my night, Kucha Kuali, was so terrible. Everything in me was paining. Maybe apart from my, my natural hair and my nails, but everything was paining. You know, I know there's a backache and the worst pain, but today I now knew the difference of a worst pain and a backache. When the back was paining, the worst will stop. When the worst start paining, the back will stop. I, I didn't know why. The dream that I had was so bad. <laughs> I was in my bedroom and my husband came. <laughs> Then he, he, he told me 
I looked at him. I told him. Whatever it is. As I was speaking, I looked. I could saw my husband figure. But between my husband and I, there was a lady. And then I was on the middle. And then my son, Kuntambalilo, he put his legs down. He was sitting the way I'm sitting. And then I saw Lala, but his legs were down on the, on the floor. <laughs> then I, my husband couldn't continue. There was no affection. He started looking at the lady that was sitting next to us. I, I I told I told I I was speaking in my heart. I said, "What is this lady doing here? I don't know her," and my husband was sh shocked. He didn't know her as well. Then she told me that uh, I need a sweet. I like minty sweets, the green ones. It was in my mouth. Then I started giving it to her, from my mouth to her mouth. I cut it in between. Immediately she swallowed it. I woke up. I didn't want to pray. I told myself that I'm not going to pray. The God who was there when this dream was happening, he knows what to do with it. I didn't want to pray because I didn't know what to say. When I woke up in the morning, I was asking my husband. I tossed throughout the night. I could sleep for 12 minutes. To me, it was like I've slept for hours. When it is 02, I look at the watch. 0 to 12, I look at the watch. Then I asked him, didn't you notice that I was having a nightmare? And then he said, no. Didn't you notice that I was in pain? Then he said, I did, and I talked to you. I asked him, what did I say? You, you just said that, mm, fide kalipa. When I woke up, I said that I need to go to church. I didn't even want to come. I was like, I want to go for a prayer line on Wednesday because pa Wednesday, I want to go to church. So when I woke up, I said that mm, this pain is too much. I can't wait for Wednesday. I got. Uh, I told my my second-born daughter to to clean the car. Kwe na was just dragging to get out of bed. I got upset. I looked at her. I was wondering why she can't just listen to that. Immediately, I realized that if I get upset, I won't go to church. I just said that, Ima mommy. I dressed up and I came. So that is what brought me on the prayer line today. Restore, 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 restore. What one? Hmm? She'll die. She'll die. Mm -hmm. Why? She'll die. Why? That's the question. That's the question. Why? Every day, paining. Paining legs. Paining where? My legs. Tummy. No, the doctor. Today you are fine. Tomorrow. Should I can't, I can't. I don't know. Which side? Her mother's side. Okay, her mother's side. Yes. They know you are so in that on that side. Let me tell him now. Liver. She's nothing. Is that one? I'll say, I'll say, I'll uh -huh. say. I say it. She's 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 the grandmother's sister. That's what she is. She's just the grandmother's sister. Who? Chapella. I don't understand. Her name is Chapella. Chapella. Yes, she's the she's she was the father's favorite. So the grandmother just said that. What, what, what is the meaning of Chapella? At Chapella in school, shown say Chapella. Just come. It's its end. Just come. Oh, it just, has come. Yes. 
Okay. Are, are you telling me that our days has come to an end? Yes. Vashapela was my daddy's mother's younger sister. So bambu ya baiche. Eba ribabu alia shapela. So I asked that Nish Mwanji Nikiri at Shapela, Nish Ishapela at Shapela in Shku. Ishku Ishan Shishapela, Daddy. He just said that he couldn't touch the Vika Kofi if you're so for a while. Now, when you could buy a Vika Kokun Tanch at Shapela in Shku, I've been in Ishwaku when this child is so beautiful and brown. Shapela in Shku Shandisha Kui Kala, Pakovat Enae Kali. So, why should she? die for me when Christ died for me? Why should she say now she's I wasn't Jesus Christ like Elisha, is it the, prof, the, the priest who saw Jesus Christ and said now behold my eyes have seen the Messiah I can rest no so that also had been in my heart I've stopped using that name but I've maybe I've denounced it because I don't use it and thank God it's not on any of my credentials so my full names are Victoria Walia Mwendapole Mrs. Chong. Yes, yes, now. Which scripture? Chapela. For me, I live by the scripture. I don't I live by Chapela. Die. Why is she in her fourth year? I didn't think she would come. 2020, the whole year she was sick. Fibros, fibros, fibros. You prayed for her. Again, she has come. Fibros, fibros. You want to pray for her. Why? Why do you want to pray for her? Why, Why did you allow her to come back? That's the question. It is her daughter who said, Mr. Shansongo said, I don't know why she said that. Lisa. Chapela. Yes. So that is her name? And I've told her that Chapela. Why did she get vaccinated of COVID? Okay, let me ch let me change your name. Shamuya Yaya. Eh? I changed Chapel, I put Shamuya Yaya. Hmm? What can you say? Shamuya Yaya. <laughs> you you went with Shapel. Like that you over. Sha? Sha Sha. Hmm? Sha. Shapela. No no boy wa muya ya ya le so wa muya ya wa like kala mudiene ya mboku ba ngrefe wa be ka mama prefere ka sio mudi How are you man This is your mom uh, You know you know this name You don't know the name This is your first time Yes Healing Chapel <laughs> Oh okay no god box here na pachalo Na no wa seven Come here, daughter. Oh, oh my. Nan was seven. Leroma mm -hmm. seven. Kalisa. Kalisa. <laughs> Who is she to you? Listen, mm. she's my favorite. Yeah. My favorite daughter. Yeah. What have you done to her? This one. Yeah. Her backbone is burning. Who is the cause? Me. And she has taken all my period pains when she's has period pains it's like she'll die okay the same way the mother was suffering yes pain. exactly exactly she's brown so you the transferred saying because she's brown so she'll take after you this one she suffers so you transferred her problem to the yes. daughter yes because she's my favorite so so much I took her from my younger sister when she was in grade two since then I've raised her and I've noticed she she's got period pains that are excruciating painful they are so painful I feel sorry for her especially that when she's not home she's in school I would feel sorry that so take my lectures because she's in in those pains as we are growing, my period pains would come like that. I could have malaria the very day. 
malaria would go after three days after the period pain. So by then I tried quite take candle yak chana kashi. So na ishwa fe for fin if in a kula fe na chena. But na ka take candle yak chana kash and it was a miracle when I had my my son, my firstborn son. I grew up with my stepmom who was so scared that I might not give birth because of e candle. So when I gave birth she made noise wherever she was in Indola just to come and see my son. And she danced saying, Na Lubuka being your stepmom, Gatawa Kuitaba and Nangabala and Jirat Nari Kloa. And that's the pain just went like that. Now seeing that she's through it keeps me worried. My name is Lisa Chuluba. Um, the lady seated next to me is my mother. Yes, like she said, I started staying with her when I was in grade two. And since then, I've been with her. She's been there for me through everything. I've practically grown with her. Yes, just to confirm what, uh, the, the, what she said about my period pains, whenever it's that time of the month, even two weeks before, I, you, I just see the signs, my legs start hurting. Every, I never stay like if I am staying healthy to so stay like for a week. For these other weeks, I would be, I would be in pain, and when the the periods finally come, I can't get up of, uh, out of bed. I can't do anything. I, if, if I try to get up, I would be, uh, I would feel as though something would drop out of my body. Even if I tried to move, I would feel as though someone is pulling out my heart. I ca I'll be in bed, I'll be shivering, I would be sick, I don't even know what I'm sick of. Yes, so it's just to confirm with what she was saying. But why are you tormenting your favorite? <laughs> Chapella, the grandmother's name. At Kabuta, Kakamuane, Kabuta, but it don't say. So, why am I saying all these things? You must say it. Jesus is more than you. God, you walk, Sela, and a pachalo. What can you say? You heard the confession of your mom. She said the same problem that she has been facing as a woman, you are also facing the same problem. Yes, Is it true? Yes. You experience the pain when you are doing your message. Very much. Very much. Yes. So you are the causer? Yes. Come here. The yellow sharp pillar. Come here. A look at this. Uh, General body depends. Who is the cause? Me. You. Mm -hmm. What's your name? Shapela. Shapela. Thank you, Jesus. Fire! All over my body. Fire! You remove the problem, you give the daughter. You remove it permanently. In the mighty name of Jesus. Fire! In the name of Jesus. All over my body. In the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, we cry. Restore our altars again. Yeah, we cry. Restore our fire again. Oh, restore. Restore our love for you again. Restore. Restore. Restore, restore, uh, restore, 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 yes we cry, restore our fire again. 
restore, restore our love for you again. Oh, church, return, return to the love again. Oh, restore, restore our fire again. Oh, restore, 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 Holy Ghost, restore, 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 oh, restore. My dad told me that it was the, the mother to my dad, now the young sister. Okay. You said you transferred your period pains to this sister. Yes, daddy, when she's sick, she's quite sick. It disturbs me a lot when she's having a menses. Uh, you said I will, I will kill her through a menses. No, 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 no. You love her so much. Yes. Uh, show me the way you love her. Uh, 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 uh -huh. You are delivered. Sharp lies out of your Amen. body. Restore our altars again. Yeah, we cry. Restore our fire again. Oh, restore. When dad was 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 coming, I I felt a hot sensation from my tummy. And then Pada pen if you think if I say some I wanted to run to go to the toilet, but I was saying, Bala Monati Ningwa Denguru, Masha's Bala Mbuesha. So I stayed calm. But I couldn't stay calm because what was manifesting in me couldn't stand. I couldn't see Pastor Mlenga as he was speaking to me until the time that I saw his shoes when I was lying down. And now, after the prayer, I'm fine. I'm fine, I'm very, very fine. When I sat on the prayer line, I told myself it was a spiritual thing and when daddy touches me, it will be a spiritual thing that will go. So I've been through a lot in life. I've been through a lot and this is the bus stop, this is the end and now live in rejoicing. When daddy said that the devil is shocked when you are in pain, you say, I'm fine. There I testify to say, I usually say I'm fine. Not realizing that I'm doing something spiritual. I just say it because, like, I need self-pity. I'm fine. I'm really fine. I'm really fine. But I'm fine. And I'll continue telling myself that I'll remain in the Lord and I'll say I'm fine. And the Lord will keep telling me to sit on the green grass and I'll keep sitting there. And I'm praying for my leftovers so that even my daughters can can take can take them and my children, my family, my husband. Um after the prayer, I believe and I have hope that it is done from Amen. now till forever. I, 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 I don't expect to have those pains again. Amen. It is done. It is over. It is the last time I'm, I'm having those pains. Amen. Um, have hope. Have faith in Jesus Christ. You would find happiness some or uh, what? in the world but that happiness will just be for a short time but in Christ Jesus there is so much peace there's fullness of joy even when you're going through uh, difficulties you have that peace that uh, other people don't have outsiders don't have so believe in God have faith have hope make Jesus Christ your friend be there uh, daddy was saying was preaching on Sunday he said we should walk with Jesus he gave examples of 
or of the child who walks with the father and the child who doesn't walk with the father so make jesus christ your friend walk with jesus christ and when you walk you will not make any mistakes in life because he will always be there to guide you so believe in jesus christ believe in him amen the word of encouragement i'll give to people is chili chonse cha mbide cha kwa tenshita ya kupwa le safie wa belelela ne chewe cha kwa le se cha belelela i have waited for so long for a long time to be delivered i'm happy that i'm free and i'm free for good and i'll maintain my 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 deliverance and my healing through Jesus Christ that gives me strength every day amen, amen.